All right, guys. So, like I said, the poll that had the Far Cry, Randy Cunningham, and Predator poll, that tied, and the two ideas that did tie were really good. So, I decided, you know what? I'm going to do both. I'm going to do both because they're both really good ideas. And, as always, if you guys would like to be part of these polls, just hit the link below, head on over to my Patreon, where you guys can start sending, where you guys can hit the first tier, and you guys can start doing poll, uh, be part of polls that affect videos here on YouTube, as well as there on Patreon. But without further ado, let's get into it with this um, with this video, which as you can see, Darkwing Duck, Duck Dodgers, and Invader Zim. So without further ado, let's get into it. So the story begins in St. Canard, and St. Canard has a problem. That problem is a giant spaceship hanging over their heads, and everyone is panicking. And, he, and, and the big question everyone's asking is, where's Darkwing? We don't know where he is. Is Darkwing gone missing? Well, no, Darkwing hasn't gone missing. He's in his lair like, I don't know how to deal with this. I, yeah. So Goslin's like, why don't you just go up there and scare him? You know, you're Darkwing Duck. Are you afraid of some aliens? And he's like, the last time I ran into aliens, I got blasted. <laughs> so he, lo eventually Darkwing, you know, gets the, uh, you know, steals himself. He, Launchpad, and Goslin all go up to the spaceship, and he's like, I, all right, you cosmic criminals, I am the terror that flaps in the night. I am the bunion on the foot of evil. I am Darkwing, and that's when he gets zap he gets blasted. <laughs> he's like, Dark, <laughs> ow. And the person who shot, who went zap on him, I don't know, went boom on him, it's not a boomstick, just, bzz, uh, was Duck Dodgers. Yeah, it's not Zim's ship. It is, it is the it is the ship of one Duck Dodgers of the 24th and a half century. And he's like, all right, you costume clown. What's the big idea dragging me all the way, you know, dragging me all the way to this stupid city? He's like, stupid? I'll have you know, this is like the 27th nicest city to live in on Earth. And he, <laughs> bucko. And he's like, oh, no. Yeah. So... Their uh, duck, do uh, duck dodgers and do Darkwing and Dodgers are already at each other's throats. The fight breaks out, but it turns out after the two keep fighting, but then the cadet and Goslin, you know, break them up and is like, "Well, what? Why are you guys here? You guys, you know, are you guys from the future?" He's like, "That's right." Uh, duck Dodgers is like, D "I am the greatest hero of the twenty-four, uh, the twenty-fourth and a half century," and uh, and cadet is just like. Just let him have this. <laughs> so they explain that something happened because they're like, this isn't our Earth. Like, we're from a future, but and this looks like the past, but this isn't the past of our Earth. And they're like, what? Yeah, we come from a universe where there's like, there's no humans here. And they're like, humans? What are humans? And he's like, yeah, we're in, we're in the past, all right, but we're not in the past of our Earth. So they explain that they uh, that uh, Dodgers and, C and the cadet were assigned on a mission to stop a unknown they were sent to investigate an unknown temporal signature that was happening in deep space they they went there and what they encountered was an unknown like rift but it wasn't like a rift in time it was it, they thought it was like a rift in time but now they realize this is a rift in the multiverse so, what happened? Someone tampered with the multiverse, and th and when they saw a ship that was behind it all, they ch they chased after them, and they're like, "We ended up here in your universe, chasing after the person who tampered with the multiverse." And they're like, "Well, who did it?" Well, that person is now running around on Saint Canard, and that is Zim and Gurr. And Zim is just like, yes, finally, I could never conquer art of my Earth, but I could always go out into the mult. I designed a machine that would be so powerful that it would punch the hole of the universe, and I would conquer a world in the a Earth in the name of the tallest and the almighty Urk and Empire. And Gur's like, who are you talking to? I am monologuing. <laughs> so that's Zim's whole big plan. He could never because of Dib, he could never conquer his Earth. But then he had an epiphany of, I just need to conquer an Earth. It doesn't have to be the Earth that I'm in my universe. So Zim painstakingly built a machine that would allow him to go to another universe. And he got thrown to the Earth of Duck Dodgers, to the world of Duck Dodgers. 
but he was like, nah, I don't like this earth. <laughs> I'm going to choose another one. And that's when Dodgers showed up and the two of them ended up here. So Dodgers, excuse me, so Zim is here on earth and he's, you know, hiding out. He's even wearing like a plastic duck bill in order to fit in with every, uh, to fit in with the locals. Um, back with, uh, with Dodgers and Darkwing, and their respective groups, they're like, well, whoever this guy is, he's probably going, he's, you know, a rift in the temporal, t in the space-time continuum is never a good thing. So, uh, why don't we team up? And Dodger, like, uh, IQ's like, yeah, let's team up. Handshake. And he's like, and Dodgers and Darkwing are like, no, no, I'm not working with the schmuck. My, <laughs> my thoughts exactly. And they're like, oh, God. The, like, and the respective groups are like, oh, God. They both have egos. So that's the problem is, like, they're... <laughs> They both want to be the hero of the of this story, but begrudgingly, Dodgers and Darkwing do get forced into working together. So they have to go out and find Zim because they uh, I uh, not IQ uh, Cadet uses the computer sensors and realizes that the longer they stay here with who, that alien who caused all this, the more there's going to be like um, damage to the uh, to the multiverse. So they have to get him get and then get out zim however has been working tirelessly he's already like he's actually formed a new version of the fearsome five he got the fearsome five out of prison after hearing about them on the television and now has created the uh, the make the fearsome five into the uh, the um <laughs> uh, the incredulous six and they're like incredulous. It's not even like catchy. What's your deal here? And he's like, I wanted sinister, but it was taken. <laughs> so that uh, so now he even Negaduck's like, yeah, we'll work for you. And then when I get my hands on that, he wants he wants the technology to get into the multiverse and cause all kinds of, of uh, shall we say shenanigans. So he's pretending to work for Zim, who pr who prides himself as the leader, and he's already getting on everyone's nerves. But they already begin an attack on St. Canard with Supreme Leader Zim, the new master of Earth, and his, and his five minions uh, instantly draw attention to the, uh, to the respective parties. They arrive on the scene, and, uh, and Negaduck's like, Oh god, there's two of them now. <laughs> oh well, more of you to kill. <laughs> so, fight breaks out. You have little fun team ups like Goslin Launchpad, you know, fighting alongside Cadet, while Dodgers and Dodgers and Darkwing basically trip over each other in the ensuing matchup. Eventually, the fight does kind of go in the hero's favor. Dar Negaduck steals the uh, device that Zim had to break the universe, uh, the multiverse, and tries to use it. But Z but however, the problem is that's not the machine. That was just a play, re a toy remote. That Gur brought the real machine. Gur has, and try, I mean Zim has, and tries to escape again. But Darkwing and Dodgers are like, no, no, you don't put me down, foul beings. And by foul, I mean birds, not foul as a you know what I mean. So they capture him, they uh, extract the machine, and throw him back into his own universe before heading back to uh, before. Darkwing and Dodgers have to go their separate ways. And he's like, well, this was a fun team up. Let's never do it again. Agreed. And the everyone returns to their respective multiverse. So there you go, guys. That is pretty much the Darkwing Duck Invader Zim Duck Dodgers crossover. You guys tell me in the comments below, what did you guys think of this? Uh, and once again, I'd like to thank everyone who voted on the poll. And uh, yeah, once again, hope you all enjoyed this. I'm Mr. Multiverse. I'll see you next time in the Multiverse.